Hey guys, for those of you who don't know, I have wiped out the hard drive on my MacBook Pro using the disk utility feature built into Leopard, and I have also reinstalled the operating system, and I'm going to make a startup and shutdown time of the MacBook Pro now. It's pretty much totally clean, there's almost no applications on there except for the ones that come with it. So I'll go ahead and get this test started and I got a timer on my iPhone that I'll go ahead and use. And we'll do a shutdown first. Here we go. I'll push it at the same time. Alright, so it took 4.4 seconds for the MacBook Pro to shut down. So much faster. If you've been watching my videos since I've started, you'll you'll notice that it's much much faster than the MacBook Pro when I transferred everything over before I wiped my hard drive. So now I'll go ahead and boot up the MacBook Pro again. So it took 34 seconds for it to boot up and go into login. So that's pretty fast considering um, this is the 500 gigabyte, 7200 RPM hard drive in it. It's not an SSD. If it was an SSD, I'm sure it'd be like maybe 10 seconds shorter. But uh, startup and boot ups don't really matter to me that much is the computer performance inside of login and rendering videos and all that stuff. So. Um, Go ahead and leave a comment. I'm pretty excited that it's faster now starting up and shutting down because I wiped out the hard drive on it. And shutting down was a big problem for me because it took like 30 seconds if you've been watching my other videos. If you haven't seen them, you can go check them out. Um, this one's much faster now. And I'll see you guys in the next video.